races even. It's like, I don't know, in general, leaving it. I'm 16 years old. I go to Torrey Pines High School. I'm on the Carmel Valley Composite race team, um, and I will be racing varsity this year for the SoCal League. Um, I first kind of got into cycling through my parents, through just dragging me to races. Um, they were big road racers in like the 90s and 2000s, so I'd drag me to races as a little kid, try to sleep in the car, and get pried out of bed at five in the morning. It was a bummer, but um, so then. Didn't really catch on to it for a couple of years, and then until a couple of years ago, a couple of friends of mine decided to go mountain biking, and then that's pretty much what sparked my interest now, was just going out there, having fun with friends, you know, goofing around on bikes. Yeah. So our, my friends were doing the Carmel Valley Composite Team, uh, so I joined them, and had a lot of fun. Uh, had some success in the sophomore category, got a couple of podiums, a couple of wins, or one win. Um, and so, got super into it, started training a lot more, uh, raced some enduro, some downhill. Definitely, it was like a big dream of mine to race an enduro world series. So, uh, this year, made it a big goal of mine to qualify for 2019's enduro world series. Um, and then, I ended up getting lucky enough to get into the lottery for EWS Whistler. So, that'll be a super big race and hopefully I can do well there. My mom was looking through the NICA newsletter. And she called me into her office and said, oh, look at this, this is a super cool trek course. So I took a look at it, super stoked on it, and then ended up flying out to Wisconsin to do the mechanic course. I think it was Assembly 101, something like that it's called. Um, so super awesome experience going out to Wisconsin, meet a bunch of new people. I ended up staying with um, Kathy Mock, who runs the Wisconsin League. So that was cool, got to experience um, Wisconsin riding, which is very different from here, but uh, less elevation for sure. But the the, the class is really cool because you get to learn from professional mechanics who are all involved with the industry, everything like that. And uh, so built a couple bikes, learned a lot about just how bikes work from the ground up. You know the internals of everything is cool. I remember. Uh, he cut off like half of a shock or something like that and showed us the internals of that so you could see actually how it works and just theoretically get it explained to you. Um, so. Yeah, I definitely recommend the course because you learn a lot about just how, not even just uh, bike mechanics, but you learn a lot about the industry. It's not just, you know, hands-on stuff. There's also, they teach you like how stuff works. Um, and then it's really cool because it got me like this job, which definitely helped my application a lot. So it, it opens doors for sure. But actually, I applied before and it, without the application, didn't hear anything back for a few months. And then I reapplied after I'd done the course. Um, and then about a month later, they called me back, called me in for an interview. So I interviewed, ended up getting hired, which is pretty cool. Um, and then I was. A mechanic for a few months and ended up switching to sales which I like more because I'm more involved with industry people and you can talk to people you know you get to meet people you never usually talk to and see like what their whole story is oh I never I used to ride back in the 90s or something I haven't ridden for a while and then you set them up on like a brand new mountain bike disc brake like 29 or super dialed in setup and they, they ride around the parking lot and they come back so stoked out of their mind and they're like oh I need to buy this right now because they're just loving it and found the new passion for the sport. So working at Moment Bicycles in Coral Valley is super helpful because get discounts on bike stuff which is nice, get a paycheck every couple weeks, fuel the, fuel the uh, passion for bikes and then it's also cool because they're a sponsor of our team, Coral Valley Composite um, and then it's also really convenient because it's super close to my school uh, and then just also local in the neighborhood. My name is JT Lyons. I'm the owner here at Mobile Bicycles. Um, we've always considered ourselves a, uh, a bicycle retailer, and our, our specific uh, demographic has been those that consider themselves a bicycle enthusiast. Uh, more so, we, we want to serve all kinds of cyclists. Um, but having Nico here has been great because he kind of brings the 
the younger demographic in and, and um, some of the racing experience has been, I think, valuable for him to relate to some of our customers at that level. Um, Nico's having a lot of fun doing the, the high school racing series and uh, some enduro racing as well. And I think being pretty successful at it. Um, his experience with the, uh, the Trek program, I think, gave him a head start starting out. He didn't come in with zero experience. He had at least a, a fundamental understanding of bikes and you know, we could teach him kind of from a, a foundation level to uh, learn some more of the, the detailed specifics that we get into working in the bike industry on a day.